Good morning, STM, and welcome to the Student Council elections of 2024 to 2025. I'm Alicia. And I'm Melania, and we are so excited to be your hosts for today. Before we begin, I'd officially like to knight your 2024-2025 Student Council President, the one and only Melania Bozzo. Thank you. <laughs> You're so welcome. Um, congratulations, Mila. I'm so happy to be passing the baton to you. You're going to be amazing. Thank you very much. Before we begin speeches, um, we'd like to announce our acclaimed positions. Next year's Vice President shall oversee and organize all student council assemblies and be the lead on prom, dances, and semi-formals. They also step in where the President cannot. Congratulations to Shanali Shankar, who is our acclaimed VP for next year. <laughs> next is our technology reps, who have such a significant role on student council. They're the creative minds behind our videos and graphics. Congratulations to Cruz DeLuca and Mikel Gomez. The next appointed position is our spiritual representative. The role of spiritual rep is to act as a liaison with the chaplain and the school charitable justice groups. Congratulations to Jonathan Kalu. <laughs> the next acclaimed position is a new position at STM. It's the role of senior promotions senior athletic promotions representative. Their the role is to promote, promote all senior athletic and school events, as well as bring optimal spirit and positivity to all our games. Congratulations to Elisa Gofredo. <laughs> the final acclaimed position is social media and promotions representative. This student will have great responsibility on student council. Through their social media expertise, they will capture, feature, and promote all student council events, as well as school events, on our social media accounts. They. They give you information daily through our DMs, and they're always on demand. Congratulations to Adriana Sacco. <laughs> and now for our speeches, before we begin, we'd like to thank all the candidates for putting themselves out there and running for council. First, we will begin with the role of recording officer. This role of recording officer is a big one. The recording officer takes minutes at every meeting and communicates the minutes to all members of council, advisors, and administration. Today, we will hear from Kiata Agro and Krisha Arzadon. Good morning, teachers, principals, staff, student council executive, and STM students. My name is Kiata Agro, and I'm excited to stand before you today as a candidate for the position of recording officer at the best school in the world, STM. First and foremost, I want to express my gratitude for the opportunity to represent all STM students. I believe that serving on the student council as recording officer is an excellent way to ensure that every voice is heard. Loud and clear, I'm committed to listening and voicing your ideas as a team. Now, let me express my gratitude and intentions if I'm elected. Firstly, I want to promote inclusivity, where each belongs. As a member of the student council, I look forward to using my skills as a recording officer for each and every event. I promise to actively listen to your suggestions and ideas that will, add, that will change for changes that will benefit us all, and most importantly, as a school community. Together, we can make our school experience even better at STM as we continue our journey of being knights. Imagine someone who loves our school and everyone in it. Well, that someone is me. I got you. Most importantly, I strongly believe in the power of teamwork. I won't be able to accomplish anything alone. We rely on each other as friends and peers in our faith to get the job done. I'll need your support today and once elected, my work will begin to show the world we here at STM are champions in all we do. In conclusion, I'm committed to making our next school year an incredible one. By voting for me, Kata Agro, you're voting for teamwork, faith, communication, experience, confidence, and inclusion. I'm asking for your vote, but not just for me, but for the vision of our school where every student feels connected, involved, and proud to be an STM Knight. Thank you for your attention. So take note, make the right vote for me, Kata Agro, as your recording officer. Let's do this, STM. Thank you. Good morning, Knights. My name is Krisha Arzadon, and before I begin, my voice is clearly gone, but that won't stop me from running to be for your recording officer for the 2024 to 2025 school year. During the speech, I am not eligible to make promises such as reducing the cap cookie prices or more civvies days. What I can promise is to make next school year one to remember. Those who know me already can describe me as organized, approachable, detail-oriented, and overall a student council material. Those would also describe me as very attentive, especially when it comes to my mom teaching me how to bake cookies without burning them. 
I pay close attention to the things going around the school. I notice how hot the calf is and how religion hall always smells like food. Not only can I provide these valuable skills to benefit the student council, but I can bring my energetic attitude, enthusiasm, and openness to this school by being your recording officer. I am determined to work responsibly with the new elected student council, administrative team, teacher advisors, and especially all of Unites. After all, what is St. Thomas more without a community full of different backgrounds, talents, interests, and abilities? Our differences are what make us a community all in one. As we move forward to the next school year, let us strive for a positive community and an excellent school year. Remember to vote Krisha Arzadon as your recording officer for the 2024 to 2025 school year. Thank you. Next, we're going to hear from our social convener candidates. This role of social convener is to handle decorations and entertainment at all student council events. This includes food trucks, DJs, balloon art, balloon arcs, photo booths, and so much more. Today we will hear from Salma Amro, Gabrielle Labracasio, and Lamar Said. Good morning, staff and students. Some of you may already know me or have seen me walking around the halls. For those who do not know me, hello, my name is Salma Amro, and I'm a grade 11 student. I would like to share some information about myself and why I'm worthy of your vote. I have always been told that I'm a great listener and a caring individual. I believe that there are no bad ideas. Another thing about me is that I'm creative, meaning whatever you bring to me, I will find the means to put to use. Additionally, I enjoy meeting new people and I enjoy having fun. The high school experience is all about making memories and having fun. Some students may feel left out or may not have interest in some school activities. I believe, together, we can change that experience for many students. Whether you're an athlete, an artist, a musician, or anything in between, we can plan events that will make everybody feel included in our STM community. I believe the secret to a fortunate social calendar varies. In addition to school dances and pep rallies, we can introduce new and more exciting activities like movie nights, talent shows, and tournaments for charity. There will be a lot of activities for everyone to enjoy. None of this can happen without your input. I encourage everyone to share your ideas, your suggestions, and your feedback with me. This isn't only my vision for our STM community, it's all of ours. Together, we can create amazing memories that will improve our high school experience and memories that can last us a lifetime. This is the end of my speech. Thank you all for listening, and don't forget to vote Selma Amro as your 2024 to 2025 social convener. Thank you. Good morning, students and faculty of St. Thomas More. My name is Gabrielle Labracasio. I'm currently in grade 10, and I'm running for the position of social convener on STM's 2024 to 2025 student council. Most of you probably don't know the purpose of a social convener, so let me inform you. A social convener is responsible for organizing events such as school dances and school spirit occasions. Unquestionably, there are many responsibilities of a social convener, but the most important one is making sure that students enjoy themselves throughout their school year. This position requires excellent commitment, communication, creativity, and organizational skills. I qualify for these traits with additional determination towards my goal to make our events fun, safe, and memorable. Communication is essential for this role. If elected for social convener, I want to apprehend your opinions towards future school events. I will be committed to this role and make it my primary mission to ensure information flows smoothly to administration. I can assure that my future creative ideas will not disappoint. I'm a very organized student who enjoys getting things done. I will make sure all school events are organized and encounter limited chaos. I want us as students to make as many memories as possible during our high school careers because far in the future, we will only be able to think of our past experiences and be reminiscent. So nice, make sure to have a positive demeanor and vote Gabby for social computer. Hello there, fellow students and faculty who are quietly evaluating my speech at the moment. I'm Lamar Saad, and I'm stepping up to the mic as a candidate for the social convener role, your future architect of awesome and purveyor of pride perfection. I'm here to throw my hat into the ring for the role of social convener, the mastermind behind the scenes of all our school events. My platform more fun, less boredom. Here's my plan. Firstly, I'll ensure our events are so vibrant they'll be visible from space. Imagine decorations that make the Great Gatsby's parties look a, like a backyard barbecue and a DJ they'll have everybody busting out their dance moves. As for themes, we'll brainstorm ideas crazier than Safari through the Amazon. When it comes to social media, I'll have us trending faster than a cat video on YouTube. Twitter and Instagram will be everywhere, like glitter after a craft project. 
Plus, I'll collaborate, collaborate closely with the yearbook staff advisor to capture all those who laugh about this in 10 year moments. In short, vote for me and let's make the 2024 to 2025 school year so epic. Thank you. Next, we will hear from candidates running for the role of diversity and inclusion representative. This student will collaborate with other diverse groups within the school and ensure inclusivity in all our events. Today, we'll hear from Nika Demandal, Matthew Michaluso, Grace Moalio, and Joy Okariki. Have you ever imagined making a difference? Something worth people remembering you for? With me, Nika Eliza Demandal, we can make that a reality. STM, I, that I understand that our school is already so multicultural. Just look around you, see people from all around the world. My job isn't just to encourage that diversity, no, it is so much more. It's bringing the already dedicated different groups and clubs, diversity, BSA, best buddies into one united community. It's ensuring that your heritage months, your days are all celebrated as it deserves. With me, not one event will be more cared for than the other. As your representative, I need you involved. I want your suggestions, your voice, your motivations, and I will ensure action will be taken. Wherever your idea takes me, I'll go to whatever lengths, even if it means swimming back to the Philippines. My role means nothing if you do not feel represented. So let's make sure that never happens, okay? Because diversity and inclusion is not made with one person. It is made by a people. It is made by us. By coming together, we will lift each other up. STM, are we a school that will back down at the face of adversities? Absolutely not. We define our self-worth. We have the power to create the impossible, the unimaginable. I've been the head of diversity social media, promotion preparations, and the tech representative. I have confidence in my abilities. Sure, to see the future of diverse, to see the future of success of STM as a diverse community, I need you to be confident in me too. STM, let's make those dreams come true. Vote me, Nika Eliza Demondal, for your diversity and inclusion representative. Again, Nika Eliza Demondal. And thank you. Good morning, staff and students. Um, my name is Matthew Macaluso. I am in grade 11 and I want to be your diversity, diversity and inclusion representative on the 2024-2025 Student Council. I'll start off by telling you a little bit about myself. I am 16, soon to be 17 years old. I have two brothers, Joseph, who also attended, attended St. Thomas More, but just finished his first year at McMaster University. And my younger brother, Charlie, who is in grade nine. I love music, every type of music, listening to it, singing, and this year I started keyboard class. I have an amazing memory just ask me a date, and I'll tell you what day of the week it fell on. I like watching sports and being around people. I was on student council my last two years of elementary school, and I loved it. I think I'm your best candidate for this position because nobody is more inclusive and accepting than me. I love people, all people, no matter their age, color, and background. For those of you who don't know, I have autism and I know how it feels. When you aren't included or made, or made to feel different and that you don't belong. I, I want us all to belong and feel included. Next year is my graduating year, and I want to make it memorable. Vote for me, Matthew. Vote for me, Matthew, and you won't be disappointed. 
Good morning, St. Thomas More. My name is Grace Mualio, honored to stand as your candidate for diversity and inclusion representative. I chose this role because together, us Knights can place hope here for the students that are voiceless and underrepresented. We stand for every student because every student matters. That is why we are standing here today, STM. St. Thomas More is already a Catholic community with a school spirit full of kind, courageous, and strong knights, but we can achieve more than that. Vote for me so together we can embody the love that Christ has shown us and let it drive us towards greater motivation to pursue our goals and enhance the well-being of our Catholic faith. Once we are all motivated and determined, together we can be successful in God's sight. Once a night, always a night, right? I've already begun promoting diversity and inclusion within STM through my dance team and the diversity team. I am blessed to be in a dance group with dancers that make me feel part of the STM community. We choreograph dances that go far from the dance room. Secondly, I place diversity in the STM diversity team by writing poems that stand for my culture. One poem I wrote was Where I Come From that was published in a book in April. I am a girl of excellence and I believe that if you vote for me, together we will be committed to being a voice for the voiceless and the light that shines vibrantly for our school. Together, let's show the world what the STM Knights are made of. So vote for Grace Mualio. Let's go STM! We the Knights! We the Knights! We the Knights! My name is Joy and I'm running for the position of Diversity and Inclusion Rep. I believe that there is power in diversity. It is our responsibility to make sure that everyone in the school environment feels a sense of inclusion. When elected, I promise to be the voice for those in the school community who feel underrepresented, unheard, and overlooked. I assure you that all your opinions will be brought to the table. I understand the importance of education and awareness in promoting diversity and inclusion. I will work with other school clubs such as Diversity, Best Buddies, and Black Student Association to work on collaborations that further create a cohesive community. Allow me to work with you all to build a school community that celebrates diversity and embraces inclusion. Remember, we are bringing joy to diversity. Thank you. Next, we'll hear from our Junior Athletic Promotion Rep candidates. This position will promote all junior athletic and school events, as well as bring optimal spirit and positivity to all games. Today, we will hear from Nina Beckage and Brian Onyango. Hey, STM. My name is Nina Beckage, and I'm running for your 2024 to 2025 junior athletic rep. I would first like to thank you all for electing me as your grade nine rep. It was an opportunity I was very fortunate to have, and I could not have done it without the help of all of you. If elected, I plan to apply the experience that I have to help the student council. I view student council as one big team, a group of people that build each other up and help each other when someone is struggling. I'm committed to being a voice for junior athletes, advocating for their needs and fostering an environment where each individual can thrive. As a junior athlete myself, I was lucky enough to be a part of STM's amazing cheer team and junior girls volleyball team. On top of that, I'm also committed to playing indoor rep volleyball and beach volleyball. With these commitments, this has shown me time management, leadership, and above all, teamwork. Sports is not just about competition. It is about trust, growth, and inclusivity. As junior athletic representative, I plan to uphold these values and ensure that every young athlete feels supported, respected, and empowered to pursue their dreams. I'm dedicated to establishing open channels between athletes, coaches, and administration. By fostering dialogue and collaboration, we can address concerns, implement positive changes, and cultivate a culture of excellence within our school community. I'm honored to be considered for the role as junior athletic rep, so don't forget to vote Nina Beckage as your 2024 to 2025 junior athletic rep. Thanks, STM. Good morning, STM staff and students. I'm Brian Onyango, and I am here today to tell you why you should vote me as your junior athletic rep. STM is well known for its excellence in sports. There's more than sports than just the game. It's about the people. First, the athletes that train m multiple hours a day in each week and put their all into the game. Second, the supporters that come out to show their support. Without both groups, sports games wouldn't be as fun as they are. If elected as junior athletic rep, 
I promise to be dedicated, approachable, and a strong advocate for athletes. I will ensure that both athletes and supporters receive the appreciation that they deserve. I will be open to your suggestions about how to improve the experience of the games if my hearts make them come reality. STM is a school of sports, and it deserves to have the best. Thank you for your time, and this is why you should vote me, Ryan Onyango, as your junior athletic rep. Thanks, STM. Next, we'll hear from our grade level representatives. They will be the voice for their grade level. First, uh, we will hear from candidates running for the role of grade 12 rep. Today, we will hear from Sanaya Leslie, Natalie Marcos, and Isabella Mora. Good morning, STM. All right, grade 11s, this one's for you. Do you guys remember in grade nine when we had to wear those masks and climb up what felt like a thousand flight of stairs? What a crazy combo, but it was quite an experience, right? Time flies. Guys, we're going into grade 12. So if you don't already know me, hey, my name's Sanaya. You may know me from my huge personality and my uplifting smile, as well as being on the dance team. Since I've been a student here at STM, student council has tried their best in trying to make everyone's school experience memorable. From school dances, class challenges, all the way down to school spirit. Vote for me, because I want our last year to be one to remember. Who, you know how our parents rave about their school experience? I want ours to be better. You know how our you, uh, who wouldn't want better songs at prom, school activities, and all that jazz? But here's the thing, it's not just about my ideas. It's about all of us coming together and making it happen. I want to hear your ideas too, because when we combine our creativity, magic truly happens. So vote for me as your grade 12 rep. Remember, for the grade 12's voice, Sanai is your choice. Hi Knights, if you don't know who I am already, my name is Natalie Marcos and I'm running to be next year's grade 12 rep. We all need a grade 12 rep who's creative and can convey the voices of all the other students. We need someone who can plan special days and exciting sports activities. I know that I can do both of these things because I am, have, sorry, I'm an outside of the box thinker and I have a year's worth of leadership experience as a prefect. This whole year, I've been helping to organize many school events, and I've learned so much about the school environment and the people in it. Although I'm telling you all about myself, this isn't really about me. This is about all of you guys and picking the right person for this position so that you guys can all have the best possible year. Thank you for listening, STM. Hey, STM. I'm Isabel Moro, running for your grade 12 rep. As we approach our final year of high school, I have a mix of excitement and determination. High school isn't just about getting good grades and attending classes. It's a journey we all go through together. This journey is filled with experiences that will shape who we will become. It's about friendships, challenges, and memories we'll carry with us for a lifetime. If you choose me as your grade 12 rep, I won't just be a voice. I'll be your advocate. I'll be there to listen to your concerns, your ideas, and your hopes for our senior year. I'm committed to representing each and every one of you. But this isn't just about me. It's about us, the class of 2025. Together, we have the power to create our final year extraordinary. Let's work together to create a positive change and to build a community where everyone feels valued and heard. So I'm asking for your support, your trust, and your vote. Let's make our mark on this school, leaving a legacy future classes will aspire to be. Thank you. Next, we'll hear from our candidates running for grade 11 representative. Today, we will hear from Kiki Bissasor and Marcus Perry. Hey Knights, have you ever felt like juggling homework, projects, and still trying to squeeze in a game or hang out with your friends? It's like trying to run a marathon with a dozen books on your head. Yep, grade 11 is no joke. But guess what? I'm Kiki Bissasor, and I'm stepping up to make sure we cross the finish line with big smiles and even bigger achievements. So, why vote me as your grade 11 rep representative? Because I'm all about making our junior legendary. Not just bearable, but full of moments so great they will be one to talk about at reunions years from now. We're definitely gonna make this one for the history books. Let's take inspiration from Isaiah chapter 43, verse 18. Do not dwell on the past. This year is about fresh starts, awesome adventures, and as well as leaving our grade 10 year behind us. It's about making sure challenge, when challenges come knocking, they find us ready, united, and more spirited than ever. So, for you that promises creativity, community, inclusivity, and a bit of insanity, the good kind, don't worry. Let's do this. 
Vote Kiki Bissasaur as your grade 11 representative. Let's make this year not just memorable, but downright legendary. Thank you. Good morning, fellow grade 10 students. I'm Marcus Perry, and I'm honored to stand before you today as I seek re-election to continue serving as your grade level rep on student council. Over the past two years, I've had the privilege of learning from incredible individuals and contributed to events that have positively impacted our school community. During my time on student council, we've accomplished many goals together. We've organized successful events like semi-formal and culture day, met all of our students' needs, and worked our hardest to improve our school community. We have fostered a sense of togetherness and inclusivity through various events and activities that celebrate our diversities and interests. As we look ahead, there's still much work to be done. I'm committed to continuing our effort to enhance our school experience and make meaningful changes that benefit us all. I would ensure that no matter what your interests are, you'll enjoy every school event we run. Together, we can continue to make a difference and create a school environment that we are proud to be a part of. You know what they say, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Vote Marcus Perry for your grade. Finally, we will hear from our candidates running for grade 10 representative. Today, we will hear from Anthony Amendoya, Josiah Christie, and Grace Jeffrey. Hello, Knights. I'm Anthony Amendoya. I'm hoping to be elected as your next year's grade 10 rep. I was this past year's grade 9 rep, and it taught me a lot from what to do and what not to do. While on council, I learned and gained a sense of responsibility a responsibility to learn how to balance my extracurricular activities with my schoolwork. How much fun playing school events are, how crazy people go at school events for beaded necklaces, and how smelly that Tommy suit is. But enough about me, now let's talk about you. As grade 10 rep, I will make sure your voice is heard. I will let all grade 10s know what is going on and what events are happening throughout the school week. I believe together we can accomplish many great things while still having a blast. I bet you're asking yourself, why vote for him? Well, I promise to put forth a lot of effort, attend every event, let the council team know what all your needs and desires are, and most importantly, ensure that we grade 10 students have the greatest year yet. Let's make this year a year to remember by voting Anthea Mendolia for grade 10 rep. Thank you. Good morning, STM. My name is Josiah Christie, and I'm running to be a grade 10 representative. I would like to start off by saying thank you to all the staff and teachers for your wisdom. Um, so, to, to all the upper grades for your leadership, and most importantly, to all my grade nines, for you have all contributed to making my freshman year a time of enjoyment, learning, and personal growth. By voting me as your grade 10 representative, you aren't just helping me get to where I want to be, but you're helping a whole student body succeed. I'm not gonna stand here and lie to you about all the things I can't change. What I will tell you is that I'll, I'll make sure to bring the change to things that need to be changed. What would our school be without our diverse backgrounds, unique traits, and special abilities? By voting me as a great time representative, I'll be sure to work, work, make. I will be sure to work towards making sure that our diverse gifts can be highlighted throughout the school, whether it's through introduction introduction of new clubs, social media, or by or by creating more organized days that are dedicated to uniqueness. Together, we can shape a school community that thrives on collaboration, inclusivity, and excellence. I hope you will grant me the opportunity to serve our class and be a strong advocate for you all. Vote Josiah Christie because together we can make a difference. Thank you for your time, and remember, your voice matters. Good morning, STM staff and students. I'm Grace Jeffrey, and I am running for the position of grade 10 rep. You're probably thinking to yourself, why should you make me vote for you? Well, I can tell you that I am a very creative person, and more than confident that if elected, the school would be more fulfilled if I was able to project my creativity. I know that I can make school events more fun and enjoyable. I mean, just look at my campaign posters. They're eye-catching and colorful. Not only am I creative though, but I am an energetic person and will put the energy I produce into furthering my work with the council. My intentions are to try and make others participate more and have more desire to attend school events and join more clubs. Along with that, I am honest and reject any nonsense that I disagree with. So what I can tell you is that everything that I've said today is the truth and nothing but the truth. I will always be honest with what I am doing and what my intentions are. I know I can make a difference in this school. Your ideas matter and your ideas will be a priority to be listened to. Vote for me to make it happen. Thank you and please consider everything I have mentioned today. Remember that I am determined like no other. Have a fantastic day, STM, and vote Grace Jeffrey for the next best grade 10 rep. Thank you. 
STM, you've heard all the candidates. The next part is up to you. If everyone can please sign into your guidance counselor's grade, L grade level LMS page, go to class tools and then surveys and cast your vote. Voting opens at 8.30 and closes at 1.30 today. Instructions are also on the announcement section of each grade level LMS page. Voting is open to grade 9s, 10s, and 11s only. Sorry grade 12s, but you will not vote. Thank you again to all of our candidates. And happy voting, STM.